Beautiful. With every letter in this mural, 82-year-old Edna Grant says there's a teenager transformed by a mentor. <laughs> we did this. After seven weeks, about a half a dozen teen painters transformed this pedestrian bridge in the middle of NYCHA's Ingersoll houses on Navy Street into a work of art. The way we did it, it came from our hearts. Painters like 18-year-old Chico Copeland, who says it was a colorful way to say thank you to his community and his mentor, Patrick Cabanis. Copeland is one of a dozen teens at the Ingersoll houses who took part in creating what he calls a peace bridge to express their appreciation to their mentors. Mentors who helped them navigate life and start their own businesses. It's part of a new program called Gifts From Within. It's like me giving back, me helping someone that, because people have helped me. And with help from a business training program called Progress Playbook and the Mayor's Action Plan, these NYCHA teenagers can create their dream companies and learn how to help their communities. Sometimes you need like somebody older. Copeland is starting a t-shirt business. He wants to donate some of the profits to help homeless youth in Brooklyn. It makes me feel so special, so good. The mural, a big way to show a little gratitude for their mentors. It also pays posthumous tribute to two beloved community leaders, Delphine Cooper, a tenant association president, and Ed Carter, the former director of the Youth Patrol. Grant says it's a wonderful way to remember these community champions. We are here. We are a community. We are a family. There is unity. And there are programs just like this one coming to several NYCHA developments over the next few months at the Van Dyke Houses in Brownsville and the Tompkins Houses in Bed-Stuy.